the first thing that we're going to do is I just want you all just to sit back, close your eyes, and this is so we get the real concept that the Holy Spirit is alive in us. And we get that revelation. So just for a few minutes, I want you just to sit there, relax with your eyes closed, pick the Holy Spirit as whatever image there's plenty of biblical images such as a dove such as water such as fire or you can envision him superimposed inside of you so um but i want you to get an image and make it real think of him he is actually living inside of you he is all around us and in us but for healing it is so helpful hello josh it is so helpful to really really get the revelation that he is in us therefore guess what everything is sanctified and holy that has to do with our bodies whether it's the food that we put in our bodies it is all sanctified by him as us knowing that and taking the hands off the wheels, taking the hands off the reins, is and knowing that he is within you. So, I'm going to run through this. Anybody that's listened for a period of time know what I'm fixing to do, but it all comes from Romans 8:11. The Holy Spirit is giving life to your body. So just relax for a minute. Close your eyes. See the Holy Spirit. I'm going to say he's as water inside of me. And so right now as living water he is flowing. He's flowing from my toes, my feet. He, he is within my feet. So all impurities are washed away. In the muscles of my feet, all the impurities. Now my feet are sanctified. And he's flowing up my legs. And so my bone, my, my muscles, my tendons, he is personally coming into contact with it and making it pure and holy. And he's going up my knees and he's touching my knees his water he is the living water and meniscuses are refreshed all the cartilage in the knees are brand new again because he's breathing into them he's flowing into them the patella the, all the muscles, the tendons, the ACL. Right now, he is touching every single part of my knees and of your knees. And now he's going up to the quadriceps, the hamstring, 
in the bone within the leg, the femur, he is touching, flowing through all of it, the arteries, the veins, all is being made completely whole. He's going through the gluteus maximus, or I'm sorry, the butt, and every single part is now being touched by the Holy Spirit, by the living water who lives inside of us, and everything is being made whole now. Thank you, Jesus. He is going up to our bellies. And in Jesus' name, out of the belly shall flow rivers of living water. That is out of the belly, up out the mouth, because we're speaking health and life. And then it's a big old circle that he's making. And right now, he's touching everyone's back, everyone's spinal column, everybody's digestive system, the reproductive system, every single part the Holy Spirit is touching right now, breathing his life into it and touching it. He is the living water which refreshes. He is going through the lungs and all the blood vessels, all the arteries, every single spot. He is there. He is touching it as living water, as the breath of life. He is clearing up the lungs, making them brand new. He is giving life to your entire body, the lungs, uh, the kidneys, the liver, right now. He is active. The gallbladders. He is touching every single organ within us right now as living water, as the breath of life. He is making them holy and sanctified and he is going through the lungs and those lungs are holy and sanctified now. And now you could take a deep breath Your airways are opening up right now. Thank you, Jesus. What the Holy Spirit sanctifies, nothing can undo that. Now he's going up your neck, up your throat, your back, your scapula, every single part of the back, recreating all the cartilage there, every part, the nerves. He is totally touching them. They are made holy right now. Thank you, Jesus. And the Holy Spirit's moving upward and all the chemical balances all the chemical things in the brain are being taken care of right now. Thank you, Jesus. He is flowing through you. He is the river of living water. He is refreshing your whole body, your sinuses right now in Jesus name. He is clearing up your sinuses. Now this is a constant 
The Holy Spirit is always doing that. So imagine the Holy Spirit always in the circle of completion. And now the sinuses, the throat. And now we are speaking life. That is how rivers of flowing water out of the belly shall flow rivers of living water so it's out of the belly up and out because we're speaking truth and life now he's going back down to the toes up through the legs everything he touches is instantly sanctified and holy that means healthy in jesus name is going up the legs every single part of your body and it is a constant repetition thank you jesus and your stomach is being restored ulcers are no longer there cancer is no longer there the pancreas the liver the gallbladder uh the hypothermus whatever that is uh all these things every organ in the body the holy spirit is renewing right now thank you jesus with your eyes still closed i just want you first let's say it because out of the belly shall flow rivers of living water he is going out the belly out of your mouth so let's speak life i will recognize the improvement that i know is there because the holy spirit has touched it now say that out loud make that confession when you confess with your mouth is believing it as you speak it now just move around just move around with your eyes still closed with you still focusing the holy spirit is flowing through you touching every part of your body is your body more comfortable is your body moving more with more fluidity the the mobility is smooth thank you jesus one who joins himself to the lord is one spirit with him 1 corinthians 6 17 you're never left alone that is impossible as we are one with him and this is a constant repetition the holy spirit is always doing this that is why i can honestly say i'm always healed thank you jesus okay so hopefully y'all like that hopefully it gave you the revelation he's in us immediately whenever we start thinking about prayer all of a sudden we want the lord to come down he ain't gotta go nowhere he's in us he's everywhere inside of us now that includes our emotions he is within us so guess what our emotions are being healed the emotional ties that we've clung on to we throw them away right now the emotional hurt because the holy spirit the liver rivers of living water is touching those memories now we are emotionally 
no longer bound to them. Amen. The Holy Spirit touches every part of my life, including the emotions, including the memories. And right now, I speak Holy Spirit amnesia that the painful memory no longer has that little mark on our heart. The bad memories I am talking about. Now we are dis disattached to them because the Holy Spirit has touched them. Thank you, Jesus. Right now, I speak that all cancers, all tumors right now have been touched by the Holy Spirit. They no longer exist in anyone's body listening to this. I speak life to that body part that had a diagnosis of cancer in Jesus name healthy cells the Holy Spirit has touched every cell in your body all are healthy and complete thank you Jesus anyone with any of the um, oh what do you call that all the neurological things so all neurological diseases right now I speak that the ne the neuro system the nervous system I speak life that every part of that, the sheath that's around, that carries the signals, all touched by the Holy Spirit and made whole now. That's ALS, uh, muscular dystrophy, uh, cerebral palsy, um, any of those neurological illnesses, Parkinson's, right now in Jesus' name. Um, and I ain't no doctor, so I, I'm just, nobody make fun of me. I don't know if Parkinson's is neurological or not, but that's fine. We're calling it neurological. Um, what else? So right now, all of that ALS, all the muscular dystrophies, um, fibromyalgia in Jesus name the Holy Spirit has given life to the nerves they're all right now sanctified by the Holy Spirit they are indeed made holy and when it's made holy it's healthy when it is the righteousness of God as we are nothing shall have a hold on us I speak to all the pulmonary, the breathing things. I speak life to the lungs, to the bronchial tubes. Um, to the, whatever, to the whole lungs, the whole breathing system. In Jesus' name, I speak life 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 the Holy Spirit has fully touched them they are whole complete take a deep breath right now thank you Jesus all that COPD all that no longer exists in your body it is only health and life of the Holy Spirit because it is holy and sanctified. Thank you, Jesus. I speak, I speak right now to your heart, to everyone's 
nerd, um, veins, arteries to each part of the heart, everything that has to do with the car cardiovascular system. Right now, I speak life, life, life. Thank you, Jesus. I speak lungs or that yeah, heart. The Holy Spirit is giving life to your heart, your blood pressure. In Jesus name right now. Thank you, Jesus. Blood pressures are normal, better than normal. Thank you, Jesus. And I, I speak, Kevin, they can explore all they want. In Jesus' name, I'm speaking, they find nothing. Life. The Holy Spirit has already touched it. It is done. Thank you, Jesus. All brain traumas, all emotional traumas, in Jesus' name, the Holy Spirit has touched and made whole right now. Thank you, Jesus. And I want each and every person, when, when you go to a doctor, you have the mindset, you already have the report. The report is that you're completely healthy. So irregardless of what you hear, you make the report of the Lord, the truth, the one that you listen to. Yes, cholesterols and the lipids and the, all that stuff right now in Jesus' name is normal. Thank you, Jesus. I speak complete health. And I speak right now, the Holy Spirit is touching all the belly fat that you don't want so right now, just speak it. My body weighs X amount of pounds. Whatever you want. And no, ladies, I'm not even going to try to guess a number. Thank you, Jesus. We can be the perfect weight for whatever is normal for us. So everything normal and I speak to broken hearts, the emotional type of brokenness. Right now, the Holy Spirit is giving everyone peace. You know, this year, I think pretty much everybody's lost a loved one this year. And I speak the Holy Spirit is placing his peace and his emotional comfort and his love and releasing it to every single person. Right now, thank you, Jesus. emotional comfort, the joy of the Lord, and peace. Thank you, Jesus. To speak to any traumas caused by accidents, automobile, anything like that, 
anyone involved in a car wreck or where there's an impact to the body, right now that is healed. Thank you, Jesus. Life, life, life. Thank you, Jesus. Now, for Diane Walker, now you can give personal prayer that you want from me. <laughs> Diane came in a few minutes late, so she didn't hear me say that part. <laughs> But I think I just about covered everything. I already got you on that one, Sister Walker. I speak a true revelation of Christ in us, of the Holy Spirit in us, to every single person. A true revelation that you know that he is in you and active and that when when he when when you hear somebody say oh heavenly father come down touch us right now you immediately think to yourself, he's already touching me because he's already always inside of me. As the fathers loved me, so have I so have I loved you. Amen. I'm pretty sure I covered all that, Joshua. Joshua. Full health restoration, strength to every muscle, spiritual strength in Jesus' name, from head to toe. Full oh, Holy Spirit consciousness. Yes, that you are aware the Holy Spirit is always in you to the point, to the point where you no longer need the physical feelings of Him manifesting, which I hate that word. You don't need to feel his manifest presence because you know he's already there. You don't need that proof. Yes. You know, the Holy Spirit ain't got to come down. He's already in us. He's already around us. When we're thinking, he's thinking. So... Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yes, we're going to enjoy that pizza tomorrow, Joshua. Thank you. Now, like I said, prior to us first starting up, I'm going to try and make this into, well, I'm not going to try, I am going to make it into a video and repost it as such. So, that's why at first I was trying not to, but we already have the report. The report is that we're healed. And so, you know, even if you have to envision 
and use your imagination and see a report in your hands that says you are healed then when you go to the doctor's office you already have that report and you know you don't even need to hear what he has to say you've got the report that matters now believe it alright so if anyone has any other specific need even though I pretty much I believe I covered the full gamut but if someone wants prayer over something specific I would be glad to do so now If not, then check out Two Bros Plus Jesus. Me and CJ. Oh, okay, yeah. Right now, I speak. All addictions are broken. Right now. Thank you, Jesus. The only one that we are addicted to is the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. I speak to the skin. Healthy skin. And the immune system. The Holy Spirit is touching, making it holy and sanctified right now. Thank you, Jesus. I speak comfort to all the cells, to the skin and all that, all of it is 100% healed, perfectly normal and strong. Thyroids functioning normally right now. Thank you, Jesus. The thyroids, life to the thyroids. Um, Bell's palsy, in Jesus' name. The Holy Spirit, the living water has touched it. And it is no more. Any mental illnesses, any depression. Right now, in Jesus' name, life. All flesh is renewed. And I pray divine health. Nothing shall by any means harm us. So therefore, nothing can come close to us. We're walking in divine health. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Diane. Yes, pancreas, life, in Jesus' name, full restoration, the liver, everything. Amen, Jim. God bless you, Sarah Lou. All right. Anything else? They went down. Different stuff. Sometimes they go on Exactly. That was. That was a general. And guess what? 
now we ain't got to dip ourselves in literal water because we got the living water inside of us. Exactly. Living water in the spirit. We are reborn, we are new creations, we are no longer mere mortals, only human, and all that stuff. Now we are sons of the living God, which means we are untouchable. Things can come at us, but they cannot penetrate the shield of the Holy Spirit. Hello, Mercedes. Thank you, Jesus. Now, I did forget. I hope y'all had a Merry Christmas. Uh, of course, I'll be able to tell y'all tomorrow, but I speak to each person that we are living in the kingdom of God this new year. We'll see more and more promises fulfilled, more and more blessings that we already have. We already have the full blessing of the Lord. We are already in his favor. And that is what I speak for this new year, that each of us are blessed and that we walk in the fullness of that blessing. Everywhere we tread becomes sacred and holy ground because the Holy Spirit is in us. Thank you, Jesus. And I want to thank every single person that listens to me, that shares my stuff. Um, be encouraged. Do not, uh, you know, we all feel down from time to time. There is no shame in that. We all can have depression from time to time. But don't stay there. We've got the living God inside of us. We can choose to reject all that negative stuff and have our healing. Yeah, y'all check out the book trailers. All these are the latest ones, the newest ones. And, um, <laughs> so let's see what else we got yeah just because I know somebody will ask this and I already spoke to it but I speak the memories um that it's Holy Spirit amnesia is a comfort of the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I like that, Jim. Yes, when you're in hell, don't pitch a tent. Keep your eyes on the victory. We are always in the present. If we keep our minds on the present, we quit looking at the past, we don't try to look into the future, but we stay in the present. And guess what? In this present state, I am holy and sanctified and healthy, walking in divine health right now. Thank you, Jesus. With that mindset, you are only expecting the blessings of the Lord and therefore your expectation and your faith is in the right spot. Hey, 
Amen. So, y'all be blessed. Be healed. Be. It is the natural state of existence that we are. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. And yes, that's absolutely right. Church Andy always has us focus on the past or the future. But never now. But God is present and now. It is always now. We're always in the present. Get out of the past. Get out of the future. In Jesus' name, right now I'm walking in divine health this very moment. Thank you, Jesus. And so are you. God bless you. Each and every one of y'all check me and CJ out tomorrow. We'll be happy, happy, happy because we had done ate some pizza. Amen. Blessings to everyone. And peace to our country. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. God bless each and every one of you, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye.